guys welcome back to my channel so today I have an Aliexpress haul it is a lot of Valentine's stuff um, I've noticed that things are coming like within weeks of ordering it now and I don't know have you guys noticed this too I'm not sure if it's the same everywhere else like here in Canada or maybe it's even just local like in BC but I have another courier company delivering Aliexpress now like it used to be Canada Post which is our national um, post service but now I have like this courier company that's like literally dropping it off right to me. So I have no idea what's going on, but it's making things even a lot, like coming in a lot faster. Anyway, I got lots to show you guys. Charms, beads, dyes, you name it. So let me start. So first I found these beautiful acrylic hearts. They come in these pastel colors and they have this white backing on them because otherwise I guess they'd be transparent. Oh, look how pretty they're just kind of like these matte hearts perfect for Valentine's you get quite a bit uh, in this pack as well and as always I will link everything down below if uh, you're interested in picking these up for yourself so next I found these really cute heart containers they have like pink crystals in them and it's got a little loop so you can hang it so so cute um here i found some tiny little lollipops i mean they are tiny tiny little lollipops look how tiny these are super cute they come in different colors of course she like to say hello <laughs> why <laughs> anyway <laughs> next I got these sequin mixes almost like just glitter and they have kind of this one has a little bit of red this one has a little bit of pink in it very Valentine's good girl and there's like an iridescence to them as well. You get a, a good fair amount. And I'm going to go as quickly as I can because I do have a lot to share with you guys. Next, I have these charms. And I'm not going in any sort of order. I'm just, I have them in a bag and I'm just pulling them out. So <laughs> cute little envelope charms with the heart. Don't mind her. She's purring. <laughs> <laughs> next I have these frosted beads they are in the shape of stars and in hearts so the star looks like that it's got like a center piece as well which I thought was so so cute the hearts um the holes are on the side not not up and down but you know I'm thinking with a plastic bail you might be able to make this into like um instead of on the side like straight up and down or maybe even like drilling a hole on the top and like sticking one of those eyelet pins in so i'm gonna give that a try but they're super cute they're like this kind of frosted pink color next i have some conversation hearts love conversation hearts that are my favorite when it comes to valentine's and I especially love pink conversation hearts, of course. These ones here all say sweet and they have a little bit of glitter to them. I have some of these puffy kind of heart patches, I guess you could say. So this one here is like an iridescent pack. They come in purples, reds, a blue, and a, a pink, and a white. Um, I got two packs of those. I think they actually just split it because I don't remember buying two orders. And then I got these ones here, which are the glittery hearts. Super pretty.
here I found some adorable ribbon and um, my friend Rula, she actually used something similar for one of her projects and she told me that she got it from Dollar Tree. Of course, I can't find it in my Dollar Tree, but I did find it on AliExpress. So <laughs> it's basically this gold tinsel edged ribbon. It comes in this kind of, I don't know, like a blush pink. And then it comes in the baby pink with the silver. And then, of course, I had to get the black for Halloween. I love these ribbons. Next, I'm so excited for these. So, so excited. So basically, these are long needles. So I grabbed the 150 millimeter, which is 15 centimeters. And I thought that these would be perfect for pokey tools. I have finally kind of jumped on the bandwagon when it comes to those. I think they're so cool and I love how you can personalize them. So um, I grabbed a bunch. I think they come in like, ooh, I say 10, maybe 15. And I also ordered the longer ones as well, but this one again was 150 millimeters. And it does have like a small eye on top so you can dangle something off it as well because I know a lot of people buy the ones from Hobby Lobby but of course I can't get to Hobby Lobby right now so AliExpress to the rescue <laughs> next I have these heart beads and they're kind of like that polymer clay material and they just say love Here I have some heart charms and they kind of have that frosted glass look. They almost remind me of like a perfume bottle. I don't know. Doesn't it? Because you got the frosted part and then you got the liquid inside. So cute. Can't wait to get into Valentine's crafting, you guys. I have these bells. These are so cute. These are heart shaped whoops heart shaped red bells they got a little heart in the corner here they're very i mean they, they jingle really well so i got a couple of orders of those next i have these polymer peppermint bits i guess um the seller was very accommodating. I didn't want any blues. I didn't want any greens. So I asked if they could just send me the reds, pinks, and oranges. And they did. I mean, they did stick one yellow, but that's okay. <laughs> Otherwise, it's exactly what I asked for, which is really nice. So don't be afraid to ask the seller if they're willing to send you a certain color. If all you're looking for is like one or two colors and they, all they sell are mixes. So anyway, we got these. So next, I have some star beads or some more star beads. These ones are smaller. They're just this cute yellow color. I'm pretty sure I bought other colors, but I don't see them right now. And then here I have these cute pink beads with the white heart in the center. So, so cute. I gotta work on some wire wrapping these. I'm like one of those people that tend to just wire wrap when the project calls for it, but maybe I'll start doing it in advance and so I have them ready to go. Next, I just grabbed some pink gummy bear charms with a gold hook. Again, this would be cute for Valentine's. Oh my gosh, I love these beads. They are these iridescent rose beads. Look at the colors, they're stunning. Um, I've, I'm gonna be using these for pokey tools, for wire wrapping. Of course, my favorite is the pink. <laughs> but I was okay with the mix for this one because you do, do get quite a bit and the other colors are just as pretty. 
Oh, these are super cute. These are little gnome ornaments. So they're just made out of wood and they've been painted. They're so cute. You get four different kinds. It's okay, you drop something. And they do have a hole already drilled on top so you can dangle these if that's what you wanna use them for. Next, I grabbed a bunch of these candy hearts. I absolutely love these things. They are like, they look like they're sugared. Aren't they cute? And they come in different sizes as well. So I grabbed many. So <laughs> I grabbed this little one, which is kind of like a pink and red combo. And then I got like more of a lighter pink in the size up. In that one, I got the pink and red combo again. And then I got even the bigger size in the same color combo. And here are the light pink ones as well. And then I have these charms here. They are so tiny. I didn't know that they were so small, but they're kind of like that enamel charm. And I got them in the orange, the hot pink, and the light pink. And you get 10 each. I grabbed some mini bells. These are so tiny. And I love the way that they sound. They come in different colors. So, so cute. And you get a bunch too. And then I grabbed these beads these are little heart beads so so cute and these ones they almost have like that frosted look again with something in the center i don't know they're hard to explain but you can probably see it i'm hoping you can see it Here I grabbed a um, like a stamping tool. Basically, I have one of those like I think it's called the Misty, and I have the Tim Holtz one as well. And then this is gonna be used to like I don't know, get a more even coverage of the stamp because I find that when I'm like pushing them myself, I always miss a part of the stamp. So I'm hoping that this is gonna help with that situation so I grabbed that oh I grabbed a an embossing folder and it's got conversation hearts and it is up there we go <laughs> wrong way <laughs> so it's got the word like hugs and xoxo hello kiss too cool I absolutely love conversation hearts as I just mentioned previously and so super excited to find that Back to some beads, I grabbed these pink alphas. Again, for Valentine's crafting. Also grabbed these, these are so much smaller than I thought, but they're so cute. They're like little, little red hearts and it's got a white heart frame in the center. And all of, you know, these ones here actually have the holes on top, which is nice. Not on the side. And then I had grabbed these charms, which is hearts, oops, with a white frame. Hopefully you can see that it's got a gold back. And even though I love Valentine's, I love hearts. I will use hearts all year round. And then, oh my goodness, look at these faceted heart beads. They're so cool. I love them. Of course, I love the pinks. <laughs> but it does come in other colors as well. But I love that faceted look to them. Oh, 
here are the other star beads. These ones are red. I was thinking this would be more for Christmas. Because I don't know, for me, stars and Valentine's don't go, but stars and Christmas definitely do. And then I grabbed these flat backs, and this is a mix. They come in the pinks and the kind of like this turquoise color and the white and the pink glitter. So pretty. Oh, you know, I just realized I only have two of the turquoise. Most of them are pink and white. Awesome. <laughs> So I grabbed this stamp set of these cute faces. I think this might be a Chaos Craft stamp. I can't remember. But look at the cute little faces on them. I grabbed that. And then the rest of them are dies. And I didn't have time to cut anything out. I'm sorry about that. But um, I will do what my friend Crystal does and put a picture in the corner of each die so you can at least take a look of what it looks like. So there's this one here which is kind of like a pepper shaker. So cute it comes with these dies as well that you can put inside. I thought that was adorable. This one here is a cute fox. This one is a flower set and I thought that these would be cute to make some of the flowers that uh, Creating for Fun makes. Here I have a cute little gnome. I believe I bought about two kinds. They have, like I have this gnome, it's weird. I have this gnome set already, but the faces are different. They changed the faces, so I, I had to get them again. <laughs> And then here I have a couple of arrow dies. This one has a heart. This one says love. I have a heart background die. I love getting heart background dies. I have like, I think every single one that they have on Ellie. I don't know why. <laughs> Next, this is so cute. This is a oven mitt and it's got a bear sticking out from it which I thought was absolutely adorable. Of course, you can use the bear separately. You can use the oven mitt separately. You don't have to use them together if you don't want to, but I will insert a picture. And then this cute mug die, it's Valentine's. I think it's Valentine's because it's, look, it's got a, a heart spoon and it's got some hearts here. I think it's very Valentine's inspired. It's so cute. And then I also have for Valentine's this perfume bottle set and these can be made into shakers and this says boy oh this one says love oh potion love potion perfect next i have some word dies this because um i had some birthday mail i did last week and realized i didn't have a whole lot of these Word dies, and this one is birthday related. It's, there's birthday, happy, time, uh, celebrate, and party. This one here is just a happy birthday layered with a shadow piece. I don't buy word dies without that shadow piece anymore because it's just so much easier <laughs> when it comes with it. Here is another cute mug die. This one here comes with like a kawaii face, but I'm not a big fan of faces on things, so I'll probably just use the cup by itself. Next, I have this die here. Kind of reminds me of like one of those like chocolate boxes, those heart chocolate boxes. So you got the ribbon and it kind of makes it look 3D because of the positioning or because of the shape of the the bow. I have a cupcake die. So I have a lot of cupcake dies, but I don't have one this size. I don't think. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I do. But I really like the way that this one looks. So I grab that. 
Next, I have this wardrobe die, which I thought was super cool. It comes with these decorative elements as well. It looks like, oh, that's a layering piece. So, so cute. It's a good size too. Here I have another word die. This one says, hugs and kisses. So, so cute. Next, I found these dies here, and this was a set. I actually liked this one here that says love, but it also comes with these two kids kissing. Here I have another happy birthday die with its layering shadow piece. And then here is a layered love word die. And then I have this cookie die set. And it is kind of Christmassy because you can see there's a stocking and there's, you know, a mitten and snowflake. But then there's also a cute heart. So I thought I'd show that just in case you wanted some Valentine cookies. Next, I found this Alpha die set. And I like the skinniness of the letters because they kind of remind me of that Ray Dunn font. So I grabbed that. And then I grabbed this die here, which creates like a cute little gift bag. And then last thing I grabbed were some nesting dies because um, I don't have that many. So I just grabbed some rectangle ones, oval, square, and circle. So that was my AliExpress haul. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I will link everything down below, but if you have any questions, please feel free to comment. And as always, please stay safe, please stay healthy, and until my next video, have an awesome day. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.